we will use the library's electronic databases and conduct a basic search to find journal articles. We will start by clicking on the link from our home page titled Databases by Subject. The library arranges its databases in broad subject areas. Click on the subject area for the databases that meet your subject or topic need. For this demonstration, we are choosing Social Sciences. There are several databases from which to choose. Scroll down the page to see the databases available. The list of databases is in two columns to ease scrolling. For this demonstration, we will choose a general database supporting thousands of topics, Academic Search Complete. Click on the title of the database to begin the search for articles. This is the basic search screen for Academic Search Complete. This search screen is similar to the basic search screens for many of the general topic databases. Most basic search screens default to keyword searching. However, you may also search by article title, author, or by subject. Type your topic in the search box. For this demonstration, we will type in climate change. Then, click the search button. A screen with the results from the search opens. This search found 27,933 articles. Scroll to see the first page of results. Because of the large number of results, limit the search to just those articles with available full text. Under Limit Your Results on the right, click on the checkbox for full text. Then, click on Update Results. The search results have been updated. You will note that the number of search results has decreased from 27,933 to 14,103 when limiting to full text. Other limiters to use when searching for articles will be discussed in another video. Again, review the results by scrolling the page. And review in additional pages. The red block shows bibliographic information for the article, such as the article's title, author, title of the journal, and other information. Each result will indicate the availability of full text since this is an option used for the search. It's tempting to just click on the full text and print it out. However, you do not know if the article is relevant to your topic. If it is not, the printout is a waste of paper. Before printing the article, determine if it is relevant to your topic by reading its abstract. It's easy. When you find an article that may be relevant to your topic, click on the article's title to read the abstract. Scroll down the screen and look for the abstract. The abstract is in the red box. The search terms you used are bolded. In other databases, they may be italicized or capitalized. Review and evaluate the search terms within the context of the article. Is this article relevant to your search? If yes, open the full text document. Read the article or skim the article before printing it out. Once you have reviewed the article, return to the results list and continue to review the search results.